Assalamualaikum and good morning. Okay, today we are going to learn Unit Eight: How the Tiger Got Its Stripes. Okay, hari ini kita nak belajar Unit Lapan. Okay, bagaimana Tiger? How um, Tiger? How the Tiger? Bagaimana harimau itu mendapat belangnya? Got it? Stripe? Got its stripes? Okay, so. Uh, we will focus on listening and speaking skills. Jadi hari ini kita nak fokus pada uh, kemahiran mendengar dan juga bercakap. Alright. Okay. So um, today's objective. Okay. Um, I hope you will be able. Uh, I mean at the end of this lesson. You will be able to name at least um, three animals that are powerful and strong. Okay, and also you will be able to express your opinions, okay, about um, the animal strengths uh, or uniqueness, and why it is proud of its strengths and uniqueness. Okay, maksud saya akhir pelajaran hari ini saya nak, okay, sekurang kurangnya kamu menamakan tiga haiwan uh, yang kuat, yang hebat dan kuat, dan juga meluahkan, okay, menyatakan pendapat kamu. Okay, tentang uh, kekuatan atau keunikan haiwan tersebut uh, dan kenapa haiwan itu bangga atas uh, keunikan dan, ataupun kekuatannya. Right? Semua ni kita hanya buat secara verbally saja. Speaking sebab because I want to see how's your pronunciation, how confident you are when you are speaking. Saya nak tengok macam mana cara sebutan kamu dan juga bagaimana uh, yakinnya kamu ketika bercakap. Okay? Okay, let's get started. Okay, so we start with few words or a few uh, phrases, okay, um, that you will learn for today's lesson. Kita mulakan dengan beberapa perkataan dan juga beberapa frasa yang kamu akan uh, belajar pada hari ini. Okay, um, first, clause. Okay, clause. And then, talents. Okay, talents. Okay, you look at these two pictures. Okay, claws and talons. Any differences? Ada nampak sebarang perbezaan tak? Claws, talons. You look at the talons. Okay, the shape a bit uh, like a hook. Okay, kalau awak tengok bentuk talons ni, dia macam bentuk cangkuk. Okay, and also a bit narrow. Dan dia macam uh, nipis sikit lah. Dia macam, okay, dia tak... Okay, uh, kalau bandingkan dengan claws, okay, look at the claws, alright, claws ni a bit curve, uh, dia lebih uh, macam uh, cembung, cembung, uh, cembung sikit lah, curve kan, okay, so compare then talons, talons a bit like a hook and claws a uh, curve uh, shape, okay, so beza dia, okay, talons ni ada terdapat pada burung-burung pemangsa, okay, a bird of prey, Okay, contohnya, okay, what kind of bird that have talons? Okay, see, eagle, eye hawk, and uh, falcon, and others. Okay, you can Google. Okay, what are the bird of prey? Maksud saya burung-burung yang um, burung-burung pemangsa ni, burung yang memang dia kuat, gagah, okay, powerful and strong. Okay, dia menangkap mangsa dia, dia menggunakan dia punya talons tu yang kuat tu. Okay, so that kinds of bird lah. Okay, what about claws? Okay, claws ni pula kebanyakan yang kita nampak dekat uh, animals like tiger, uh, lion, uh, bear, okay, and etc. Okay, dia punya bentuk pun lain kan nampak antara talons dengan claws ni. Dia tak sama. Okay, so uh, kalau kita nak cakap macam ni. Uh, all uh, talons are claws. But not all claws are talons. Uh, okay, like that. Okay, <laughs> cuba fahamkan. Right? Okay, next. Um, uh, prey. Okay, prey. Prey maksudnya pemangsa. Uh, mangsa. Bukan pemangsa. Mangsa. Prey. Dan prey ni lebih kepada mangsa khususnya untuk haiwan. Okay, uh, kalau tengok gambar-gambar ini. Right, dan ini. Tengok bagaimana haiwan tersebut menangkap mangsa dia. Okay, hasil selepas tangkapan. Haiwan yang dah ditangkap tu atau dikejar tu, itulah kita panggil prey. Okay. And then, uh, next, um, paw. Okay. Paw, 
haiwan tu punya tapak tapak tangan ah sorry tapak kaki okay animals like um, tiger cat okay if you have cats at home kalau ada kucing kat rumah kan you can see their paw okay the pink color pink tu especially untuk macam cat ataupun hamster animals that uh, yang tak berapa nak liar lah okay not wild enough okay uh, I mean yang kamu yang kamu pet yang kamu bela dekat rumah okay kalau tiger dia punya paw tak ataupun lion dia punya paw tak se, tak uh, tak semerah jambu macam paw cat lah alright okay the next um, enemy enemy you know Okay, you always play games and you know what is enemy are. Uh, enemy is, okay, musuh. And then, sharp vision. Okay, pandangan yang tajam. Next, um, see miles away. See miles away. Maksudnya, dia boleh uh, nampak. See, boleh lihat. Okay, miles away. Jauh berbatu-batu. Itu maksud dia. See miles away. And then, carry loads. Okay, I show you the picture. Okay, you can see what I mean by carry loads. Nampak kan? Okay, you can see the elephants and also the horses. Okay, they are carry loads. Okay, dia bawa beban. Loads tu maksudnya beban, carry, bawa. Jadi, dia bawa beban. Ada ada beban yang berat lah. Ada yang uh, bawa manusia, ada yang bawa barang-barang, ada yang bawa hasil-hasil uh, pertanian ke. Okay, so that means carry loads lah. Okay, on their back. Okay. Alright, now let's talk. Okay, jom kita bersembang ataupun bercuba lah. Okay, bercakap. Alright. And then berdiskusi. Okay. So, you turn to page 71, your textbook. Buka muka surat 71, buku teks awak tu. And then, okay, you look at the picture. Okay, tengok gambar ni. Alright. Okay. And, so, and also, you look at the below questions. Questions below. Okay, tengok soalan-soalan di bawah ini. Alright. Okay, so question number one. What animal do you think this is? Okay, question number two. Do you think it is unique? Why? And question number three. Predict its character characteristics. Okay. Soalan number satu maksud dia. What animal do you think this is? Kamu rasa haiwan ni apa? Haiwan apakah ini? Okay, so... Okay, as for me, if I'm answering the question, kalau saya jawab soalan ni, saya akan kata, hmm, pada pendapat saya lah. Okay, what animal do you think this is? Uh, I think this is a cat. Well, I think this is a cat. Okay, a big, I guess, a huge cat. Okay, um, do you think it is unique? Why? I think the cat is unique, okay, because it is huge, okay, besar. Saya rasa unique uh, kucing ni sebab dia ni besar. And then why? Okay, because it is um, huge lah, okay. Uh, and then I can see uh, the size, okay. Saya, saya tengok dia punya size tu pun dah macam dah nak sama besar dengan pokok tu, okay. A bit, uh, okay, like the tree. Third question, soalan ketiga, predict. Uh, its characteristics okay um, jangka kan okay predict uh, um, anggarkan apakah wataknya karakteristik watak binatang ni okay so um, for me uh, I think this cat is strong and it has a sharp claws and also um it like to it likes to eat meat. Mm, that's the characteristics. Okay. So for you, okay. So you can tell me anything, any opinion, okay? Any uh, you can express any opinion about this animal that you can see in this in this picture. Jadi awak boleh cakap apa sahaja dia okay, tentang haiwan yang awak nampak dalam uh, gambar ni. Uh, right? You can answer all this question. Okay, there no there there's there's no such a uh, right or wrong answer okay but okay jawapan awak tu kenalah berasas okay takkanlah awak nak kata I think this is an elephant takkanlah ni gajah okay something yang a bit similar lah okay macam tadi saya kata ni mungkin saya rasa ni mungkin kucing cat okay so I want to hear from you 
okay your opinion all right okay what about uh, when you're answering all these uh, three questions okay okay and then next uh, turn to page 73 okay kamu buka muka surat 73 okay you look at uh, the first uh, picture there okay on the top tengok bagi atas tu okay you can see the animals are looking uh, through the water okay are looking at the water sorry jadi uh, haiwan tu tengah tengok air tu kan okay look at the pink box okay focus on that Okay, listen to me, dengar. Okay. I am proud of my sharp claws because I can catch and eat my prey. I am also proud of my big paws because I can fight my enemies. Alright. So, ada beberapa perkataan ni tadi kita dah uh, sebut pada mula, uh, mula video ni kan. Jadi, kamu dah boleh agak maksud ayat ni. Okay. I am proud of my sharp claws. Saya bangga dengan uh, kuku saya yang tajam, sharp claws. Because, sebab I can catch and eat my prey. Saya boleh tangkap dan makan saya punya mangsa. Okay, so bila awak bayangkan eh. Okay, when uh, this animal has a sharp, okay, sharp claws. Has sharp claws. Bila dia ada kuku yang tajam. So, Uh, they use the sharp claws to uh, to catch okay to catch and also to hold the prey jadi dengan adanya kuku tu barulah dia dapat pegang dan juga uh, pegang tangkap dan pegang okey bayangkan kalau kuku dia tak tajam ataupun dia tak ada kuku langsung ha, macam mana dia nak pegang haiwan tu nak tangkap haiwan tu macam kita jari kita panjang kan so kita boleh pegang easily senang betul tak but animals dia punya paw besar macam dia, dia nak lengkungkan tangan dia nak pegang mangsa dia so that the use of claws ah itulah gunanya claws tu okay okay next i am also proud of my big paws because i can fight my enemies saya bangga dengan tapak tangan saya yang besar tu supaya sebab saya boleh lawan saya punya mangsa Okay, eh, sorry, musuh-musuh saya, enemies Jadi, bila paw dia besar Dia bolehlah dia hentak dia punya musuh tu ke Ataupun dia tumbuk Bukanlah tumbuk tu macam ni, okay Itu, itu human tu, manusia Okay, means that Kalau awak tengok Okay, cuba tengok video pergaduhan Ataupun video fighting between these two animals Okay Tiger defeat a lion. In a one-on-one -on -one fight, the tiger has all the physical advantages. Plus, the tiger is a more experienced fighter than the lion because the tiger hunts its food alone, while a lion is dependent on its prime. Hunting alone for the lion would be very hard, especially the male lion. Yes, it is possible, but it rarely happens. Take a look at this and see for yourself how powerful a tiger is when fighting against the lion. You can clearly see that the tiger moves quicker and faster, standing and defending its ground, showing the lion who's the stronger and more powerful predator in the land. So you saw just now how the animals use the, their paws, okay, its paws, to fight the enemies, and also how they use their claws, okay, uh, it to to catch and also to eat the prey, all right. Okay. Now, look at these four animals. Okay, you can see these four animals in your textbook, page number 73. Okay, I want you to choose one of these animals and talk about their strength or uniqueness and why they are proud okay, of their strength or uniqueness. So, ini saya nak awak pilih satu je haiwan, antara empat-empat haiwan ni. Okay, satu sahaja dan cakap okay, dan, dan bagi pendapat awak tentang kekuatan ataupun keunikan 
And then kenapa mereka bangga dengan kekuatan ataupun keunikan mereka Okay So you can use the point below Okay awak boleh gunakan point-point uh, uh, yang ada bawah setiap gambar tu Kan ada tu Alright and then uh, you can use the point below to talk about the animals Okay And then uh, for example Okay Kita tengok dalam kotak pink tadi semula Okay Dia mulakan ayat dengan Alright, I am proud of my sharp claws. Jadi kat sini, I am proud tu kekal. Jadi bila awak nak tukarkan, bila awak nak bercakap, okay, I am proud of, okay, apa dia? Point yang ada tadi. Right, contoh tengok dekat, um, tal, uh, sorry, dekat eagle ni. Okay, dia ada point, sharp vision, uh, see prey miles away, powerful talents, kill my prey. Jadi, kat sini awak hanya gantikan sahaja, Alright, I am proud of my sharp claws tu Gantikan dengan I am proud of my sharp vision okay, Because I can see my prey miles away Alright, macam tu Okay, and then next Okay, I am also proud of my big paws tu Kamu gantikan dengan I am also proud of my powerful talents Okay, because I can kill my prey Nampak tak kat situ bagaimana dia gantikan uh, Perkataan ataupun frasa tu Dengan uh, point yang baru okay, Jadi sekarang turn kamu okay, Kamu boleh pilih Haiwan tu sama ada Either eagle, horse, lion, elephant okay, Pilih antara empat ni sahaja Dan sebutkan uh, tentang apa yang saya suruh tadi Pada awal video tadi okay? So that's all your task Don't forget to record your voice and send it over through the send it over to Telegram. Okay, thank you for watching. Bye.